I get asked by parents all the time, how does it taste? So let's find out. First, we're gonna taste all the ibuprofen. Then we're gonna taste all the Tylenol. So we're gonna start here with the berry flavored Motrin. Let's see how that one goes. I give it about a six, it's not so bad. Um, a really fruity, now it's got some aftertaste. I think I'd wait on that one. Now the grape. Oh, it's grapey, but it's smoother. I'm gonna think grapes better than the berry. And finally, let's taste this last one here. This one here is the bubble gum, not high hopes. Yeah, I'm right there. But you know what, there's no aftertaste. Bubble gum wins. When it comes to Motrin, bubble gum's the way to go. Now Tylenol, this is the strawberry. Oh, that's good. Like you could make a shake out of that. That's some good stuff there. Okay, next we have the dye free cherry. It's good. You can, you can, the sweetener's not nearly as good. I'm going with the strawberry so far. And finally, Tylenol grape. It's not bad. I guess with Tylenol, it tastes better than ibuprofen by far. I think I'd go with the strawberry over the grape. But if you're going to do the ibuprofen, you want to stick with the bubble gum because the aftertaste isn't as bad.